Hi, I'm Paul Heaney, Editorial Director for Design World. I'm here in Cedar Point in beautiful Sandusky, Ohio. Joining me today is Monty Jasper, who is the Vice President of Corporate Safety and Engineering here at, at Cedar Fair, actually. And we're standing in front of the Power Tower, one of the taller rides in the park. And it's, uh, Monty, tell us a little bit about it. It's sort of uh, four rides in one, and it's a little bit, uh, it's part pneumatic cylinder and part shock absorber. <laughs> That's correct. Uh, it's it's an all pneumatic uh, powered ride. The ride is very simple in that it, it, it emulates a flagpole. You have a cable going over the top shiv and a lower shiv, and the vehicle's attached to that. Sure. All right. So what we've done is the, they've attached a piston in a cylinder to the cable itself, and they move that piston up and down with air. Mm -hmm. So uh, when they load the people onto the ride, they will weigh them, check the weight, and we'll calibrate how much air we want to sure. thrust into the okay. cylinder to make the ride move. Mm -hmm. Um, the, the piston is at the top, the vehicle is at the bottom. Mm -hmm. So when we shoot it, the piston will move earthward and the vehicle will move skyward all the way near the top and then it will trap air in the bottom mm -hmm. of the cylinder and compress it like a spring. Sure. So the vehicle will shoot up and it will slow down near the top and then recoil earthwards afterwards and kind of give you a bungee cord effect mm -hmm. looking. It does the same thing in both directions until it finally stops moving and then we can shift air and move it to the ground for unloading and loading. So, so, so two of them shoot upward and then two of them shoot downward, right? That's correct. We have two uh, uh, two shots and two drops. Mm -hmm. The drops are just reverses of the right. shots. They have everything opposite so that it shoots the piston in the opposite direction that, that the shots do. Great that uh, this ride uses pneumatics. It's probably one of the only uh, technologies that you could use to achieve that kind of a ride, but it's a little bit, uh, I understand, of an energy hog too. Well, yes, we got very, very large compressors that are that are that are you know greater than 150 horsepower that are running all the time on these uh, this ride to keep it supplied with air. So it is a little bit of an energy hog, uh, and it also uh, shoots people earthward at the at speeds greater than gravity would push on you. So there are many drop rides, but this one is a drop ride on steroids. But uh, the other thing with pneumatics on this ride, I'm, I'm guessing it's uh, pretty maintenance-free from your perspective? Oh, it's a very reliable ride. It, uh, you know, it, it has a computer program that gauges the weight, gauges the input of the air, and essentially shoots the ride up and down. But it's a very, very simple ride for us to maintain and to operate. Makes your job easier. I'm sure that's always top of your list. you got to have a few of those around the park to make life easy. Well, thanks for joining us here at Cedar Point. Again, Paul Heaney signing out. Check out all of our videos at www.designworldonline.com. Thanks for watching.